Hello YouTube, this is Bleach Chapter 676 Review, and let me just tell you guys, this chapter was hype, I mean, we all knew that this chapter was probably going to be good, and I'm proud of Kubo for not switching to another fight, I think Kubo knows what he's doing, I think Kubo knows that he doesn't need to switch to the Miracle Fight because he knows that this fight is hype, and he wants to show off Ichigo's new powers, and as I kind of speculated, this is his powers combined. It's his, it's his hollow powers with his Quincy powers, and I'm pretty sure it's fused with his Shinigami powers. And I don't think Fullbring's in there because he didn't mention Fullbring. He may not have his Fullbring powers anymore. But uh, one thing that was pretty cool that someone mentioned to me, I believe it was in a live stream, and I was uh, we were talking about the Bleach chapter. I wasn't live streaming, but. It was in a live stream and I was chatting with this guy who was in the chat room as well and he said that he thinks that the Fullbring powers are fused with the Shinigami powers uh, way back from the Fullbring arc and I kind of forgot about that so I think they're actually fused so he may still have his Fullbring powers or just fused with the Shinigami powers but as I kind of speculated it was right it was his Quincy powers and his Hollow powers together and obviously his Shinigami powers because he, how would he be there in the Soul S Society without like a gi guy or something, or well, not a gi guy or or something to help him? But I'm pretty sure he still has his Shin. He's using his Shinigami powers as well, but because obviously he wouldn't have Gatsuka. I don't know what I was thinking. I don't know why I said that. Uh, obviously he has his Shinigami powers because he still has Zongatsu. So let's get into this review, okay? So we start off this chapter with a Kurosaki Kun, okay? I know everybody's gonna be talking about that. And, uh, well, Ichigo basically, he's telling Orihime, back me up, okay? Back me up. And Orihime didn't really do that much this chapter, but she really didn't need to. And, like I said, there's been uh, quite a few dialogue in these Bleach chapters, which I, I seem to like. I mean, there was a lot of pages with action towards, like, the end, which was great. I want to get into the end at the end of this review but I like how you know or he may hopefully she's gonna do something I mean she did something in the previous chapters uh, and so hopefully she'll do more and uh, Ichigo like he already said he's told it or he may get back there and you know uh, help with safety and stuff like that so yeah I mean th 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 this fight is gonna be good hopefully I mean it's already been great and I just love it so like I said it's already confirmed that his new powers is you know the hollow powers his Quincy powers and his Shinigami powers and he has control of it too because at first or he was like oh crap it's this stuff again oh no oh no I don't know what to do and basically he's like no or it's me I'm under control. He's like, I got control of it. And, uh, you know, I, I like that. But he still hasn't mastered it yet. But it seems like he told you Bach that, you know, it kind of helped him a bit. You know, or something like that when he was fighting him. And I like that too. But then we get to the real fight. And you know this fight is going down when Juha Bach says... It's time I pull out my sword. Like, this fight is getting serious. When Juha Bak, that guy, he pulls out his sword, you know, you have to know that he is serious and this fight is going to be greatness, okay? So, now we get Ishigo attacking Juha Bak, and, you know, they collide and stuff, and Juha Bak's like, you know, uh, quite predictable, just different, uh, di just different result or something like that this time. But Ichigo, you know, he he surprised them because he is fusing a Getsuga with a Sero. I mean, that is crazy. Yo, th this is going to be amazing, and I don't believe the attack has hit Juha Bak yet, but. This is greatness, okay? This is greatness. I don't know how I am going to review this chapter because all you're going to hear me say is, this is greatness. This is greatness. This chapter was great. I love 
how Kubo put the Cero and the Getsugo together and the attack is going after Juhabak. And that's basically my review in a nutshell. And this chapter, it was good. I like how things are going. I like how Ichigo's powers um, are basically what we thought they were. I like how he hasn't mastered it yet. I like how, you know, Juhabak pulled his sword out. You know, uh, the only problem I have with this chapter, I'm gonna say, you know, Orihime didn't do that much, but she really didn't need to. So I'm gonna give this chapter a 9 out of 10. I never really like to give chapter perfect 10 out of 10s because I find there's always a flaw, okay? There's always gonna be a flaw. I don't care who writes it. There is always going to be a flaw. So I don't want to give the chapter a 9 out of 10. Uh, 10 out of 10. I want to give it a 9 out of 10 with the fanboy. The fanboy inside of me screams 10 out of 10. He says, Zeno, why aren't you giving me a 10 out of 10? And I just said it. And boy, oh boy, I might get some negative feedback for my hypeness. But who cares? If you are a Bleach fan, this is a great day. Just like last chapter was a great day. So if you are a Bleach fan, just give me a like. Comment down below. Tell me what you thought of this chapter. Do you think that Orihime needs to do more? Or do you think it was okay in this chapter since this chapter was mostly just fighting and she didn't need to help? So, tell me down in the comments below. Tell me if you are hyped for this Sero and Gatsugo fusion. And do you think that Kubo is going to switch over to the Miracle Fight? Fingers crossed he doesn't. Hopefully he won't. But anyways, guys... Subscribe if you already haven't. I like I said this chapter was 9 out of 10. Fanboy inside of me says 10 out of 10. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed this review. All you Bleach fans out there, get to go and the Cero mix-up is looking amazing. Anyways, guys, have a nice day. I'm out.